Hey, what's up everyone? Josh Quinone is here. Now I know it's been a while since I've reviewed any kind of earbuds here on the channel, but I've actually been using the OnePlus Buds Pro 3 right here in my ears for quite a few weeks now. And I just, I got to share my experience with you guys because I have actually been enjoying these earbuds very, very much. I mean, these have been my go-to earbuds since I've got them. I like them that much. And as you can see, yes, they are already in my ears. That is because what you are hearing right now is uh, my voice coming through the microphones on the earbuds right here. Yes, this whole first portion of the video is all going to be recorded using the microphones from the OnePlus Buds Pro 3 because I've actually gotten a lot of positive feedback uh, about how I sound coming through the microphones on these earbuds right here when talking on the phone. So I thought, you know what? Let me go ahead and just use these microphones to record my voice for this, for, you know, this first portion of the video, however long it takes before we go and look into the app on the device itself and see all the different settings that we have for these earbuds right here. And my OnePlus 12, I'm currently recording on that device because it does allow me to use these as the microphone for recording sound. It automatically uh, jumps over to the earbuds to record sound, which is actually a really cool feature. So y'all can let me know what you think down in the comment sections below of what you just think about the overall sound quality coming from the microphones here on the OnePlus Buds Pro 3. Now you'll notice here in my hand is the actual case for the OnePlus Buds Pro 3 themselves. And I gotta say, I actually really like the case that these earbuds come in. It's a really nice case, really soft to the touch, kind of like a leatherish material on the front and the back. Of course, in the front, we do have some OnePlus branding. And then going to the back, we got co-created with Dyn Audio. So just reading that alone should already tell you that these earbuds are going to sound really good. But we'll get to the sound here in a little bit. Down at the bottom, we do have a charging port, USB Type-C, but these are also wireless charging compatible as well. So if you don't want to plug them in, you can always throw them on a wireless charger or use a reverse wireless charging on your OnePlus 12. Boom, set them in the back of that device and get these charged wirelessly. Going inside, we got a nice magnet that keeps these, uh, Keeps the case nice, closed nice and tight. So as you can see, it's not gonna flip open if you shake it around a lot, but just overall nice looking case. But that is it for the case. Let's talk about the earbuds themselves. When it comes to comfort, at least for me in my ears, obviously, you know, of course, everybody's ears are different. Some of us have bigger ears, some of us have smaller ears, some of us have more medium sized ears. It's really going to depend on you and your ears and how you like your earbuds to fit. For me personally, I find these earbuds very, very comfortable. I don't have any ear fatigue when wearing these for a long period of time. They actually do a really good job at staying in my ears as well. Now I do recommend going through the ear tips that come in the box with these earbuds right here because you wanna make sure you get the most secure fit possible, the best fit possible because not only is it going to give you the best sound possible, but it's also going to give you the best fit possible to make sure these earbuds are staying nice and secure in your ears. So right here, let's go ahead and do a little shake test. We'll start off lightly, go to the right, my left, go a little bit harder. My hair's probably swinging around like crazy. Let's go a little bit harder. <clears throat> ah, these are not, these are not falling out of my ears. As you can see, they're still nice and secure. So if you're someone who likes to use your earbuds a lot for, you know, going jogging, taking a run, uh, working out, you don't have to worry about these falling out of your ears if there is a lot of movement in your exercise, or even if you're at work, if there's a lot of movement at work, you don't have to worry about these falling out of your ears. Now I will say, if you do sweat a lot, you might find them just kind of, you might have to readjust them every now and then because of course, yes, the sweat will make them just a little bit slippery. So you might have to readjust them a little bit, but even when sweating a lot, I don't find myself too much having to, you know, push them in constantly because I feel like they're going to fall out or anything. Like I said, they do a really good job at staying in my ears and they are very, very comfortable. Now, personally, when it comes to the design of the earbuds, I've been someone who has never really liked the stem kind of design here. But, you know, I think OnePlus actually did a really good job with these ones right here because in my opinion, even with the stem, they actually look really, really good. I don't find them to be an eyesore when they're in my ears or if I imagine them in somebody else's ears. They're actually very nice looking earbuds. So when it comes to overall design, I think OnePlus did a really good job. Now, of course, these are active noise canceling earbuds. So you have an active noise canceling mode. You also have a transparency mode and then you have your normal mode, which is when both of those other modes are off. And I will say right now, I am currently using that transparency mode so I can be able to hear myself when talking to you guys. And the transparency mode is actually really good. It's probably not the best transparency mode that you would get in a pair of earbuds, but 
For me personally, at least like right now, I've, I've been talking this whole time. I'm able to hear myself perfectly. I'm able to hear, you know, someone else if they were to come in the room and talk to me because I have used these, um, you know, in transparency mode when talking to someone else. And I can still clearly hear the other person talking to me as well. I can just snap my fingers. I can hear the snaps perfectly fine. Any little sound in this room, I can actually hear really good coming through these earbuds right here. So like I said, maybe not the best transparency mode. I'm sure it can be, you know, a bit better, but I mean, overall, I think the transparency mode on these earbuds is actually very good. Now, when it comes to active noise canceling, for me, it's perfectly fine. I mean, it, that active noise canceling actually works really, really good. Once you turn on that active noise canceling mode, it really mutes everything in the room or even in the car. Sometimes I use these in my car because my car can be a little loud <laughs> inside. And once I turn on that active noise canceling, I feel like it just, it kind of makes the ride feel a lot more smoother because everything is just more quiet or, or more muted, I should say. Of course, you know, there are going to be some sounds here and there that you will be able to hear or you know you will still be able to hear things very lightly around you but you won't be able to hear them normally if that makes sense so when it just comes to overall noise cancellation um, i think it's really good especially when you're listening to music then it's really going to block everything out because uh the music obviously you're going to have noise coming in your ears so that alone is going to block out sound and then you have the active noise canceling turned on and that, you know, even more is going to block out everything else. And you're just going to be able to sit there and enjoy your music or enjoy your gaming or, you know, watching content on your smartphone or tablet or whatever it is you have these connected to. So just overall, these do a very good job at blocking out sound, even in normal mode. Now, when it does come to the sound on these earbuds right here, this has, has got to be the main reason why I love these earbuds so much is because of the sound. Now, I know I don't go around testing every single pair of earbuds that are out there. I'm sure there are other earbuds that are much better than these ones right here. But for me personally, I am more than happy with these earbuds right here. I think OnePlus did a very good job. And I, I mean, I said the same thing last year with the OnePlus uh, Buds Pro 2. I absolutely loved those earbuds. And then coming over to these, it's a nice little upgrade coming from those ones right here. I mean, OnePlus still did their thing here with the OnePlus uh, Buds Pro 3. I mean, the sound is amazing on these earbuds. I really don't have any major complaints at all when it comes to sound, whether I'm listening to music, whether I'm watching content or playing games. I mean, the clarity is there. You're getting good highs, mids, and lows, especially the lows. If you know me, if you've been following my channel for a while, you already know that I love a lot of low end. I love some good bass. I like to feel what I'm listening to. And these earbuds provide that. They provide a good low end especially when listening to, you know, to music with that heavy bass, whether it's, you know, a kick drum or just, you know, the bass itself, you're really going to get a good feel for it within these earbuds right here. But they also do a good job at giving you, you know, that stereo listening experience and you're, you know, you're able to hear, you know, little, in, depending on what kind of music you're listening to, you know, you could, you know, distinguish where instruments are coming from, you know, depending on how they have, you know, certain songs mixed. Sometimes they will have, you know, a guitar playing on this side or, you know, another guitar playing on this side or whatever, a violin or whatever it is, you're able to distinguish where it's coming from. So these uh, earbuds do a very good job at that. And like I said, it's just overall really clean sound and they actually get pretty loud as well. I listen to them at around 80% volume. Sometimes I'll push it up to 100% if I really feel like it, but sometimes that can be a little too loud depending on what I'm listening to. Like I said, these can get really loud, but I'm usually, you know, somewhere around 80%, 70 to 80% volume, and these are more than loud enough. So when it comes to overall sound, I mean, you're not gonna be disappointed I promise you will not be disappointed <laughs> with these earbuds, right? At least that's just based off of my own personal opinion uh, when it comes to the OnePlus a Buzz Pro 3 right here. Of course, they do also um, offer spatial audio, but we'll talk about that when we get into the app because in the application is where you can actually switch up to a fixated uh, spatial audio or you can actually have it to where, you know, you're turning your head and it feels like the music's over here, but it kind of you know, kind of mutes it over here. Not too much, but you're still able to, you know, tell everything's going on over here. You turn this way and then it's the same thing. It just gives you that effect, almost as if you're at a concert, you know, all the music up there on stage, you turn your head, you're gonna hear more of it in this ear or more of it in this ear, uh, you know, depending on which way you're turning your head. And that's where kind of what spatial audio does. 
you know, when using it with these earbuds right here or any type of earbuds. But just overall, I mean, I have been loving these earbuds right here. Really don't have any major disappointments when using them with gaming. They've actually done a pretty good job when it comes to regular games. It's fine. I've had instances in the past with other earbuds when playing shooting games where there's a little bit of latency to where, you know, if once you shoot the gun, you hear the sound of that shot just, you know, like a split second later, just or not even a split second, but just a tiny bit later than when you're actually, you know, hitting that button on your on your device. But these actually do a really good job of that. I, I really sat there and really tested it out. It's like, OK, is it instant? Is there a little bit of latency? And I kept doing it over and over and over again, you know, from what I'm hearing to what my eyes are seeing and it almost feels like it's instant i'm sure there's probably still a little bit of latency there but they have really really you know closed that gap of latency i guess you would say and it almost feels like it's instantaneous now when it comes to those shooting games so they actually did a really good job this time around when it comes to that when using these uh for gaming now when it comes to watching shows you know whether you're watching youtube disney plus netflix there's no latency at all i mean the sound syncs up just fine to where you know you see them talking on screen and you know the sound is synced up perfectly with what's going on on screen if that makes sense for those of you who don't really you know or who aren't really familiar with what latency is um so yeah it does a very good job with that as well but now that you know my thoughts on these earbuds right here and why I love them so much, let's go ahead and jump into the app to see all of the uh, customization options that we have with these because you can really customize them to really fit your needs and really give you what you want when it comes to a pair of earbuds. So let's check it out. Okay, really quick before we move on, I did notice uh, throughout editing this video that I forgot to mention battery life. Now, all I can really say about battery life is that battery life has been great for me. I've been able to use these for quite a few days before having to throw them on the charger. Now, I'm not sitting here measuring how many hours I'm using them, how many minutes I'm using them. All I know is that that I use them, you know, every day, you know, here and there throughout my day. And I'm able to use them for, you know, three, four, sometimes five days before having to charge them. Of course, you know, I'm not using them for hours and hours, you know, every single day, every single day is different. But all I can say is battery life has actually been pretty good for me. And I don't have to, you know, worry about throwing them on the charger the next day or two days later, at least when it comes to my usage. Of course, everybody's usage is different. Some will use them more than others. So, you know, just, I just wanted to go ahead and mention that when it comes to battery life, it's actually been pretty good. Okay, so taking it over to my OnePlus 12 right here, as you can see, I am currently in the settings for these earbuds within the Bluetooth settings right here. But if you do not have a OnePlus device for yourself, if you are using another Android device or an iOS device, you can still use these earbuds with either one of those. They are still compatible with any other device, but the only thing you will have to do is download the Hey Malady app in order to get all of these extra features that come with these earbuds right here. But for this video, I'm going to use my OnePlus 12. So going into the actual settings themselves, as you can see, I got my uh, media audio HD turned on. Now you do have an option to be able to switch between standard and HD. Got it turned on for phone calls as my input device. Got my uh, device volume sync turned on. It syncs your Bluetooth device's volume with this device. And then we have earbud functions. Now this is going to take you to the spot where you can customize these earbuds to, you know, depending on how you want them to sound, what you want them to do. So as you can see, I have transparency mode turned on. They are still currently in my ears because if I take them out of my ears, so they are now out of my ears. As you can see, it turns that off automatically. And then once I put them back in my ears, then it will turn the transparency mode back on and it will allow me to switch between the three of these. So if I wanna go over to noise cancellation, I can do that as well. And now I can barely hear myself talking to you guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and switch back over to transparency mode. But if you want to be able to switch uh, back and forth between these two without using the app itself or going into your device itself, all you gotta do is press and hold the stem on the side for a few seconds and then it will automatically switch over to the other mode now going down we got the sound master eq as you can see currently got mine on a bass like i told you earlier i like a lot of bass in my music or just whatever it is i'm listening to but we do have a balance mode which is the default we got a bold mode serenade mode bass mode of course and a dyne audio feature which balances bass mids and treble and to replicate the sound of dyne audio speakers which that's also a good sound mode to use as well and then we have bass wave, which you can turn on or off, dynamically boost bass to deliver deep bass with clarity and fidelity. And I, as you can see, I told you guys, I like a lot of bass in my music. I got that turned up all the way to a strong. And then you can add an equalizer 
as you can see, which I have not done yet because I have just honestly been happy uh, with the way it sounds right now. But within this equalizer, you can turn up, you know, if you want more lows, you can turn up the lows, you can turn down the mids, turn them up. If you want more treble, you can turn up the treble. You can really customize, you know, the mids, lows and highs um to to get it to sound you know the way you want and then once you're done you can rename it or close it and then you got your custom setting ready to go there but i'm going to take it back to base so i don't forget yeah so a very very nice feature to be able to customize these uh to sound the way you want and then you got a high res mode play audio in high resolution i do have that turned on you got the golden sound get studio quality sound customized to your ear canal structure and hearing characteristics now i do have one set already i did test that out and it basically gives you like a little uh, I guess like a little uh, hearing test. And based off of that hearing test, it's going to give you your own custom sound, as you can see here. And this is the uh, sound mode that it customized for me on its own. So a nice little feature there too, if you wanna go ahead and use that. We got spatial audio, which was uh, which uh, is what I was talking about earlier. I do have that turned on and I have it on fixed. You do have head tracking, like I mentioned earlier. So it's going to track your head and give you that you know that experience that i explained earlier but i'm going to go ahead and keep it on fixed and the spatial audio actually does a very good job on these earbuds right here and then going down we have neck health if i go here i don't really do anything with the neck health to be completely honest with you guys but i mean it's there if you if you decide to get these and want to mess around with that it's going to take you over to the health app you got zen mode air listen to calming nature sounds through your earbuds so you can turn that on or off just to kind of you know calm you down if you just kind of want to relax you got you know white noise like forest rain you got court night or courtyard meditation morning park countryside camping summer waves so yeah as you can see i haven't used these three right here but i did test out summer waves and uh forest rain right there going back we do have the earbud controls so right here you can customize how you want your earbuds to basically respond to you so a quick squeeze on the left earbud will play or pause i got that set up for both the left and the right a double squeeze left earbud will go to the next track triple squeeze will take you to the previous track and then you can slide on the left of your earbuds go up and down as you can see it's giving you a little demonstration right there uh, for volume control or of course you can switch these up to do uh different actions as well if you want but this is how i have mine set up right here the squeeze and hold earbud stem will allow you to switch between noise cancellation or transparency mode or turn them off you can actually have all three of them set but i usually just have it go back and forth between noise cancellation and transparency and then you have in-ear detection so it'll auto play or pause whether you know if you remove either earbud uh it will pause the audio for you and then once you put it back in it will automatically start playing your audio as well and then you got switch audio channel after you remove your earbuds audio in calls and certain apps will play via the device receiver or speaker and you do have the option to be able to use one earbud at a time as well you don't have to have them both in your ears if you don't want to you can use one um, by itself as well and that is all of the uh earbud controls right there we have camera related settings headphone recording like i you know talked about earlier you also have camera control when using the camera you can double squeeze either earbud to take a photo which is a really cool feature you got dual connection connect two devices at the same time and switch between them easily so if say if i want to play music on this device and then but i want to switch over to another device once i pause it on this one and start playing on the other device it will automatically connect to that other uh, device very cool feature there you got an earbud fit test of course choose your ear tips that make a good seal with your ear canals for better noise canceling and that's what i you know told you guys you know earlier in the video make sure you are using the right fitting ear tips to get the best fit possible and you got to find my earbuds feature as well which basically just plays a loud noise through the earbuds to help you better find them you got your firmware update and that is it so overall i mean i have really really been enjoying the oneplus buds pro 3 right here when it comes to overall sound the fit the design is actually really nice as well and just the you know the features that comes with using these earbuds as well have very much been enjoying them but y'all let me know what you think down in the comment sections below if you do find yourself interested in these earbuds i'll make sure i have a link down in the uh description below so you can check some out for yourself but do these possibly sound like something that you know would fit your needs when you know it comes to listening to 
just overall audio or if you have some for yourself what do you think about them overall let me know down in the comments if you did like this video and find it helpful make sure to give it a huge thumbs up don't forget to subscribe hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss out on any other future videos to come thanks so much for watching this is josh quinones i will see you on the next one peace out